The Air Assault Expeditionary Force, it's the premier live discovery experiment for the United States Army and it's run by the Soldier Battle Lab here at Fort Benning. A lot of what we experiment with goes directly to the soldiers in, in combat today. The experiment now in its fourth year tests, evaluates and improves emerging technologies and concepts for integration into the battlefield. We look at technologies that are coming out of industry that may be a benefit to the individual soldier and the Army. These technologies provide soldiers with better situational awareness and better intelligence on the enemy, which gives them a decisive advantage and can save the lives of the warfighters who use them. There's a lot of interest in small unmanned aerial vehicles. There's a lot of uh, interest in robotics. Uh, we have all of that here. Uh, we have even large vehicles that are robotically controlled, uh, unmanned systems. Networking the soldiers with unmanned technologies, sensor systems, and state-of-the-art communications enhances their capabilities, effectiveness, and safety in battle. This whole experiment is very important to the Army. Uh, the Army has made a significant investment here at Fort Benning. This experiment continues the Army's evolution of merging soldiers with modern technologies to create a safer, better informed, and more lethal warrior. Uh, anything that you can use that's unmanned that helps you prevent a soldier going into harm's way, there's a lot of interest in that. The AAEF experiment has been so successful that TRADOC has decided to extend the campaign for several more years. Continuing the campaign to protect and better equip our soldiers for battle today and in the future. Ron Andrus, Fort Benning, Georgia.